my main research area it was urban remote sensing, urban climatology and ecology, environmental sustainability. I went to the United States to pursue a doctoral degree in 1993. I'm one of the earliest researchers in urban remote sensing so far. I have made some progress in advancing theoretical understanding and empirical knowledge of urban key islands, urban sprawl, and environmental sustainability. We developed a methodology for estimating land surface temperature with satellite-derived measures of vegetation. That has become a core technique in urban climate studies. My research has also demonstrated that and warming are coupled with such risks as infectious disease. Taken together, my research has a bridge gap between geography, landscape ecology, and environmental science. My interest in the production of educational materials and resources has played an important role in training future generations of scholars. I have published a total of 14 books so far. An introduction to contemporary remote sensing is a standard textbook adopted by numerous universities worldwide, serving as editor-in-chief of the ISPRS Journal of Photogrammetry and Remote Sensing since 2015. I, along with the co-editor-in-chief, redesigned the journal's strategy directions and editing methods. The journal has since witnessed a noticeable increase in the quality of published papers. As a global STEM scholar, I'm delighting the JC STEM Lab of Earth Observation. This research infrastructure will focus on the development of original and innovative AI methodologies and technologies for geomatics and their applications for cities and urban areas, with the goal of becoming a global R&D hub in GeoAI. A direction of my recent work is to explain local urban research to the global scale by investigating human-environment interactions in urbanization with various processes, settings, and stages by utilizing geospatial analytics, geo-AI, and big data methods. Another direction is to create various data products of global urban areas using Earth observation and to provide EO-based urban data services. The third direction is to develop new methods and techniques to assess and monitor human settlements and activities and associated impacts. 